Good evening, good evening. A big hello from Jerusalem, the holy land of Israel, where I am staying. Can you all hear me well? If you can hear me, please time yes into the chat window. Good. Okay, so I can see two, three. Okay. Okay, four. Okay. So uh, it looks like I'm um, okay getting through to you quite okay. Now, um, so I'm doing this uh, webinar to you from my hotel, Ramat Retros, in the uh, suburb of Jerusalem. And uh, I'm lucky to be in a place where I have a very nice view okay, of Bethlehem, the place where Jesus uh, Christ was born. And um, the weather now is quite... Um, uh, fine for me it's 10 degrees Celsius outside but the humidity is low so things dry up very quickly and I need to make sure all the time that I drink a lot of water all right um, now as I have said in the email sent to you in this um, session we are not going to learn new tunes uh, uh, as, as um, uh, the face-to-face -face meeting uh, in this session, I will try to discuss the um, issues that arise from the technology projects and um, see how we can, uh, you know, uh, improve uh, things that you are working on. Now, um, as usual, I need to uh, know who are attending this webinar. And I believe that okay, attending this webinar will, you know, uh, bring you experience um, uh, for using computer in language teaching so uh, please log into our mobile learning system okay mlearning.acmup.edu.vn uh, and yeah click on uh, the link that asks you if you attend our online webinar okay I will mute on the microphone so that um, you have, you know, let echo noise uh, from your friends' laptops. Right. Um, so I give you three minutes for taking attendance, and then um, we will start okay, looking at your projects. And uh, if you have questions now, please get prepared to ask because. This is uh, the only webinar that I can give you while I am away from home. And sorry that I cannot give you two webinars as I originally planned because the work schedule that I have in Israel is very tight. They make us work day and night, literally. <laughs> During daytime, we do school visits, we attend lectures, we uh, go to workshops, and at night we have group work and tons of other things to do so um, I cannot make it um, I am able to do this webinar because on Friday afternoon in Israel and, and, and in, in the Jewish uh, religion in the Sabbath okay, the time where you do not have to work but you see <laughs> okay, we have okay, our webinar in, 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 instead Right. Um, okay. So keep uh, taking attendance um, in the M learning system, and if you have questions, um, just you know tie into the chat window. Uh, the first question is from Phuong. Okay, I would like to know the location for the photo scene project. It can be any location. Uh, it can be you know our department office it can be uh, the G204 okay, room it can be uh, our okay, university campus it can be um, uh, Đức Bà Church it can be okay, the independent palace any you know any locations that 
uh, that that make you feel interested will be fine. Okay, so getting back to the online attendance, um, I can see 12 people now. That's good. So nearly all of you have already uh, taken the track. Well, I do not quite understand okay, your questions, Hai. Um, the scene time. What do you mean by the scene time? With photosynth, uh, you only need to take pictures and then upload or use your smartphone to snap pictures and they will automatically stitch together to create a photosynth. Uh, so what do you mean synth type? Okay, now um, for the scene, for the photo scene, I only need you to get familiar with using photo scene, so I do not require you to create. Um, well, by the way, let me turn on my webcam a little bit. Okay, I see a persons. Um, hello, Chum. It's nice to see you on the webcam. <laughs> Can you hear me? Uh, yeah, it can be a walk, okay, spin, a walk, okay, anything will be fine. Alright, so I will, okay, switch my webcam on for a moment, and uh, if the internet connection is not very good, I need to switch it up to say bandwidth for our audio connection. Um, yeah, okay, so any type of photo scene is fine for me. Now, I'm sharing my desktop. Can you all see my uh, desktop now? Everybody? Now, if you can see okay, my desktop, please type yes into the chat window. Yeah. Okay, good, good. So, any meeting is, you know, improving a little bit. It allows me to share that stop that you can see. Now, on your desktop screen, you can see um, the Dropbox folders share to own groups. Let me put it here. Yeah. Um, now let's now look at okay, um, in this ten unit one. Uh, yeah, the, the first project. Um, when I look at what you are doing here, I can see a lot of creatures, which is fine. Um, now, when we when you submit the folder. Uh, make sure that okay, it is in a layout where our friends can look for things they want easily. So I want, okay, for example, if these are hot pot exercises, put all of them, all of these files in hot pot okay, folder. Okay, so put these into a folder. All the images should be in a folder. All the videos in a folder. All the hot pot creatures in a folder. And then, okay, at, at, at you know the roots of the folder. I mean, okay, when I open the folder, 
I should see the index file only the index file and when I click on the index file it takes me to okay the corresponding folders that what I need so um, of course this is still work in progress let me okay open the content page Uh, yes, I can see list of exercises here, but um, this is not a website that we expect yet. Well, I think we start to have sounds problem now. I get a message from Phuong saying that the sound is not very good, so I will first turn on the webcam. Now um, I'm also recording this meeting. Um, we will end before half past ten. <laughs> I I know okay, it's late at night, but uh, I cannot make the meeting early because just before this we had a meeting for the uh, cognitive linguistic class. Now um, are you still with me? And do you still see the screen? Now is everything okay? Please uh, type yes into the chat window if. You can still hear me and see my screen. Okay, good, good, good. Now, um, so now let's look at unit two. In unit two, I can see basically the same thing. So, okay, uh, unit two of English ten is very similar to unit one. Okay, you have uh, now only finished the uh, hot potato exercises. And when I click on index, okay, let's see how it goes. Oh, um, this is an ED quiz exercise. Let me okay, open another hot pot exercise. Ah, oh, this is Quizlet. Okay, good. Now, so in project two, I mean, you need to up in this ten. Um, what I need your attention is the top navigation. You see index and then the forward buttons. A lot of students forget to remove this. Now, make sure that okay when you okay put index and people click on index it takes them to the index page or to the home page if you do not use it remove them okay remove the forward and the backward buttons and if you leave them there uh, make sure that they work uh, of course uh, you haven't finished yet so that's what I can tell Oh, in unit three, I do not see anything. So if you know people working on project, uh, uh, unit three of English ten are here. Make sure that you, uh, you know, speed up, okay? Because it's now the first week of December and. Uh, What is uh, the due date? It's Christmas, right? So you have only about three or four weeks left. Okay, I have a question. How to remove the symbol like the forward or the index symbol on the f on, 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 on uh, hot potato pages? Easy. You only need to open these pages in Dreamweaver and in Dreamweaver you only need to select delete that's it very easy now okay so going to you need for uh, I like this because now I can see uh, a folder uh, hot potatoes for containing the files now, remember what I told you in the class. 
later on your project will be posted to our department website and if you leave a space in the folder names like this hot potatoes it will become percentage 20 and it looks it, it makes our links to the exercise very long and ugly so my suggestion is to okay remove the space or yeah replace that with a dot yes it will look better right let's keep working on the project now got the unit five oof um, look like you have done a lot of things but uh, this is not very <laughs> well organized you see uh, uh, you have a photo photos here let me see what's inside good and you have a lot of photo look like you are going to create a photo synth that's nice but uh, these you know creatures should come into a quiz folder okay looks like people start to forget what I said at the beginning right before you work on your web project plan the folder structure like okay we should have a photo for photos a photo for videos a photo for hot potatoes a photo for quiz list then okay a photo for the web pages and and then okay the index page connect to all of those things now let's look at unit 6 oh unit 6 is also empty we have got now two empty folders so uh, if you are working on unit 6 of unit 10 make sure that you uh, hurry soon otherwise uh, I'm not sure that your project can be finished on time and then Unit 7 Okay, uh, with Unit 7 and Unit 10, I can see a Go Animate folders. Well, let's see Okay, what we have here uh, Look quite nice from the thumbnail Okay. Wow. Looks good. Good. This is a good go animate clip. Okay, so uh, everybody, can you still hear me? Okay, look like the computer is slowing down, okay, like in the previous project. Now, um, oh, somebody is okay, leaving the microphone on. So please turn off the microphone. Okay.
Yeah, that's a better. I have muted okay, uh, one of our participants' microphone. Now, so in unit eight, I do not see anything yet. Please, okay, speed up. Unit nine, nothing yet. Unit ten, okay, good. You see a folder on my website. Let's come inside and okay I see the index page now let's have a look and see how we can make this project better good um, the design of the page looks nice quite beautiful and look like everything is almost done good job you have a go animate clip here and uh, now don't do not try to click. Okay, you are working on my screen and you are seeing my screen. Okay, not your screen. Some people just join and they leave their microphone on. Okay, uh for example in this case you should make sure that the okay links work. Well, um, so all the images here okay, are fine, but then okay, this one is broken. So check everything. So good. Looks like your project is almost ready. Um, with the resources, design looks very nice. I only need you now to check to make sure that the links uh, work well, and uh, make sure that you uh, have a lot of resources because, as a rule of thumb, the more resources you have, the higher score okay, uh, it will be. Uh, can you hear me? It look like we do not have the microphone. Well, um, um, this is it. Uh, we are having a technical problems. Um, I think the internet connection is not very good. That's why the microphone is not working. But uh, as I have said, as I have said, okay. Um, 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 okay, Let's recording the screen, uh, but anyway, let me, uh, 
Let me try this. Okay, lock out and restart. I will try to restart my any meeting platform to see whether you know it makes a difference. Enter meeting again. Hi, um, I think the microphone is back. Can you hear me? Um, if you can hear me now, please type yes into the chat window. Okay, it's good. I'm so happy to see. <laughs> yes, 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 coming up. Well, uh, it look like we are having a problem with again with any meeting. After about 15 minutes, then they just you know switch up my microphone, and I need to sign out and then sign back in. Okay. We are good to go. So back to my desktop screen. I hope you can see my desktop screen. Good. Now, um, so for the unit ten, I need ten. Um, uh, it's fine. Look like you have put in a lot of work, and you have ready. You are ready. Now there are two commands that I want to make. Number one check to make sure that all the links work okay i can see one or two broken links in your website and uh, number two um, try to add okay as many resources as you can because in the website i can see uh go animate i can see um yeah some hot potato creatures i'm not sure whether i i track those hot potato creatures i can see some creatures but i um I do not see photo scene yet. Yeah. So make sure that you have you have that. Now English eleven unit ten. Wow. Okay, copy the files here. And you have the uh, go animate for movie clips. So only the movie clips are ready. Uh, I think you also need to okay, uh, work harder <laughs> to catch up with okay, the schedule. Uh, you need to uh, let me just you know extract this file here to see what is inside. Okay, look like you have got lots of things here. But why do you zip it up? <coughs> oh, nice. So you have the go animate videos, the hot potato exercises, and the links work beautiful. Uh, but the design, you know, look a little bit simple. Now, if you want to improve the designs of these hot potato creatures, this is my advice. Open the hot potato creatures in that that you have, you know, exported. You see, when you finished, hot potatoes allow you to export to web pages, and then you can open these web pages in Dreamweaver. And now inside Dreamweaver, you can add uh, the uh, background, you can um, add sounds, you can make a lot of changes that 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 you can see in the previous project in our resource center. Okay. Just switch this up. 
Okay, so oops. the hot potato creatures from the different parts of okay, the unit. Now, um, it's good to put them into folders like this, but still, what I'm looking for okay, is a more, you know, a better organized structure in which we have, okay, one folder for image, one folder for the videos like Go Animate, one folder for okay, the lesson plan, the PowerPoint files, and the other things, and then, okay, at the you know, at, at, at the okay, top of the folder, like at the root, I see the index. Okay, not this link. This should be like okay, index or default. Okay, and the index file is where I will begin. Now, you need 3 of index 11. There's nothing here yet. <laughs> this is not good. What I'm looking for. Okay, look like we have an interesting project here. With uh, Dreamweaver folder. Okay, a lot of folder. Now, okay. Let me start the index page. Okay, this is fine, but look like you are still working on it. Okay, so okay, you have a range of buttons here, and the uh, frame of the page is ready, and look like. You are waiting for the contents. Okay, the design is good. Keep working on that. And now for the last project, it's still empty. Okay, so this is bad news. Uh, about five projects out of 15 are still completely empty. I do not see anything to make comments yet and obviously you need to work harder. I have told you we are running out of time and um, the sooner you can um, you know finish the project uh, you know the more relaxed you can feel when we get to the end of the course especially okay, um, in the next three weeks you need to yes. prepare for the other exams now I have finished the review of all of the um, projects that we are working on do you have any questions or comments now we will be in the uh, question and answer mode you can unmute your microphone and raise your questions or you can put that into the chat window too okay Phương you want to say something um uh, in, in the project um I need to see the range of technology that you have learned in the class. So uh, yes, in the website there should be at least one photo scene uh, uh, there. You know, so um, you see, once you upload the images to photo scene, it allows you to get an embed link, and then you can embed your photo scene inside the website. Uh, it it's just like a lot of hotels and schools. Okay. Um, do when they want to show okay, the beauty of the landscape or the beauty of the, their school. So I want you to do the same. I want you to create a photo scene and then embed the photo scene into your website so that when I open your website, I can see photo scene somewhere. Okay. A any other questions? Somebody is typing a question.
Khánh Hiền à. Sure, ok, thank you have a question? Uh, ok, so now I have something in uh, unit 3 Wow, look really nice, you have a good template Ok, this is uh, response to design <laughs> And you haven't made changes here, but okay, this is a good template to use. Uh, but I, yep. Well, you do not need to make a lot of changes. Just just try to change the text that they 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 provide in the template. So, like instead of web development here, you might need to you, you might put something here like hot potato creatures in user uh, interface like uh, uh, like uh, you need to photo scene or uh, okay photo scene up okay a uh, place. I'm trying to be creative because I'm not actually working on your unit, but. You can train the text and and then put links here so that when the user come to your home page and they they click on this, it takes them to the page uh, up 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 your project. Okay, but I can I can see that this is a nice template. You can keep uh, working on it. It takes time, uh, but by solving okay, these problems, um, you will learn a lot. And professional designer own cells do the same thing we basically get a nice template to begin with and then we make changes and updates um, okay good now any others somebody else Now, if you want to ask questions, just click on your microphone. When you click on that, it will be the unmuted mode, and you can, you know, ask questions to the whole group. Okay, I have some. Now, okay, I get a questions, uh, two questions, one from Hai and one from Duan Khang. Now, um, do we have to create a presentation with 20 slides? Now, the PowerPoint presentations are the kinds of PowerPoint file that you use for teaching, um, for teaching um, the unit. So, just okay, imagine yourself being the teachers. In, 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 in a high school and uh, and you need to take those units uh, when you take you need to prepare PowerPoint lessons I'm uh, sorry PowerPoint files okay to present the lessons right so I do not have a limit for the number of slides but usually for a 45 minutes lesson uh, about 10 to 20 slides will be enough so it depends very much on on, on your teaching plan really but I do expect okay, some PowerPoint files that you use to take the content and that will be also a lot of teachers look forward to they want to download your PowerPoint files and make changes um, this is how we you know contribute content to the community of teaching okay now uh, for the photo scene let me have a look okay sorry it doesn't work on this browser 
let me try here instead Okay, it's working. Now let's look at this photo scene. Mm, I don't have time to install it now. Hope it will show up. Well, sorry, hi. <laughs> um, I cannot see the photo scene. I need to install Silver Line, but it will take time. Um, uh, but. Uh, it's okay as long as you have a photo scene up here that will be fine and what I want you to do is to copy this iframe code copy this and paste it into your HTML page so that um, your photo scene can show up look like you are doing a good job Um, we do not need a PowerPoint files that um, introduce your website. Um, the introduction to your website should be in the About Us page in which you say very briefly about your group, about your project, about what you do with the website and something you want to say to the audience. That's it. Okay, any more questions or comments? Okay, another question. Um, now, as a rule of thumb, the more resources. Now, this is it. The project you are working on is the evidence that you have learned the different technology in our class. Okay? So, you just use, use a, web, a, a website and show the technology that you have learned. But that's one thing. The other thing is you work on a unit of Okay, the new textbook and you build resources for that unit your project will be used for the other teachers in, in, in schools all around Vietnam they really need these resources of course they will not use resources as okay, you design they will make changes but um, they will use these resources to support their teaching it saves them time so what I look for in your project will be those resources that all the teachers need for their teaching. So the more resources you have, of course it requires more time and effort. The more resources you have, the better your project will become. Now, so what are those resources? Number one, hot potato exercises. Number two, PowerPoint presentation, PowerPoint file that you will use to tick vocabulary, tick grammar, tick reading, tick listening. What else? Uh, Go animate videos. Um, we have seen one or two very good videos in, in these sessions. Uh, auto collage photos. Now, just try to think up okay, the, the different resources that you can create but those resources should be used to support the teaching of the unit and remember teachers all over Vietnam will use your website to okay, make their work easier so try to have a lot of resources if you can now is that clearer to you? Hi. Good. Any other questions or comments?
Okay, uh, yeah, go on, Khoa. What is your question? Um, maybe is it better if you tie your question into the chat windows because um, your microphone sounds very choppy on my computer and I can't hear you talk I can see the microphone working. Just somebody is speaking. I'm not sure. I think. <laughs> now, no, I do not mean that you have two PowerPoint files. Now, for the introduction to the website, please just design a web page. Just put the, introdu the introduction text onto the page. For teaching, I need you to design many PowerPoints fine, not only one. Now, I need you to design, okay, let's say one PowerPoint for, you know, ideally, there should be one PowerPoint file for teaching vocabulary, one PowerPoint file for teaching grammar, one PowerPoint file for teaching reading, one PowerPoint file for teaching uh, listening. So there, there are about six or seven different parts in a unit. And how do you teach? You need to prepare PowerPoint files. It can be one PowerPoint file for all the parts, but it's better to break them into different parts. So. Um, yeah, design PowerPoints file and then okay, link those files to your website. That's what I mean. Yes, we you do not need to link PowerPoint file directly to the index page. You can create a button on the next page, for example, teaching resources. And in that teaching resources area, you can link to the PowerPoint files. Okay. Any other questions or comments? Last question, okay? We are going to finish very soon. Last question. Okay, look like we have no other questions now. I would like to thank you all for participating in this online webinar. And um, it's a um, very nice experience for me to uh, work with you, you know, five hours okay, away from home. Uh, I am now in uh, Jerusalem and it's half past five in the evening. It's Okay, starting to get dark outside, and okay, it's now the beginning of winter, so uh, it gets dark quite early. I know that it's now half past ten uh, in the evening in Vietnam, and it's time for you to go to bed. So I uh, just say, 
Okay. Goodbye and good night. Okay. So bye bye. Uh, okay, thank you. Well, don't don't worry. I am experienced in in cold places. I know how to deal with the coldness, so it's not a problem for me. Um, the problem I have now is uh, I have too you know many things to do while I'm here, and at the same time I also need to you know okay uh, solve the tasks. Okay, back home. All right, yeah. But anyway, you know, I'm enjoying my, I'm enjoying myself a lot, and um, yeah, it's nice. Okay, having this webinar with you, okay, I, I feel less homesick. Okay, switch on the web, the, the, the webcam a little bit, and I also have chance to learn a lot about the culture. And the history of um, Christianity uh, is it not safe here. <laughs> Actually, around this week, there have been several terrorist attacks with knives in Jerusalem, and um, the police do not want us to <laughs> go out. Um, but um, wow, you know, I think, I think it's it's chance in a million and I'm not scared <laughs> anyway in Vietnam there are more people okay died from traffic accidents than than, than people died from terrorist attack here in Israel okay so um, goodbye for now and good night sweet dreams okay and I will see you when I go back uh, home at the end of December bye bye